Charles and Camilla were on board the aircraft carrier HMS Queen Elizabeth today for a ceremony marking this year's 40th anniversary of the Falklands War. In the carrier's huge hangar, they met veterans of the campaign as well as serving personnel and their families. Our Royal Editor Chris Shipp reports. There was a moment this afternoon for today's sailors, soldiers and airmen to remember the task their predecessors took on 40 years ago. Prince Charles and Camilla joined veterans of the Falklands conflict in Portsmouth today to honour the 255 British lives lost in the South Atlantic. From this harbour in 1982, a task force of more than 120 ships and submarines set sail for the Falkland Islands, 8,000 miles away following the Argentine invasion. Among the ships which would not return was HMS Sheffield. We glance to our right and we see this fireball coming towards us and he immediately recognised it as Exocet. The paint was peeling our boots were melting. Everyone I'd just been talking to in the galley were killed. 20 men on board Sheffield lost their lives. Another Argentine attack took out the helicopters, which led to the now famous Yomp, the trek by 4 5 commando from one side of the island to the other. A medic who did that 60 mile Yomp spoke today of the trauma he still carries. I just sort of fell into a, a black hole, I, I drank excessively and um, I didn't seek help, um, uh, but... Um, and it's a reminder of the long-lasting impact of mm. military conflict on, on, on people like yourself. I guess it is really, yeah. Four decades on it might be, but a reason to remember how the scars from the battlefield are never quick to heal. Chris Ship, ITV News, Portsmouth.